You know, I'm a big sucker for card games and I'm a big sucker for survival games. I grew up on, on survival games, games like Lost in Blue on the Nintendo DS. There's gonna be at least one of you <laughs> that knows that game in my comment section. Today we take a look at Swappy World, which is a, a new demo that's out uh, in the Steam Next Fest. You can find a link to it in the description down below so you can play as well, uh, where this is a, a card-based survival game where we're gonna be swiping the cards to move and then tapping our cards to interact in an open world survival crafting experience. Seems fun to me. Uh, reminds me a little bit of a, an amazing game, Card Survi is Card Survival Tropical Island? Is that the name of it? I can, there's four words, Card Survival and Tropical Island, uh, and I can never remember the order they go in, but I think it's Card Survival. <laughs> it's a great game. Um, I get very similar vibes from this, and I, I think it's going to be a good one. Let's check it out and see what's going on. Um, enter a name for this run. Uh, this is just going to be Olenki. <laughs> and then we're going to start. I should do... I should I should do Alextra. And then I'll tell you, uh, hey, I have a new channel that we're posting uh, multiplayer and uh, stream VODs on. You can find a link to that in the description. Go subscribe if you want more uh, Alexa content. Extra Alexa content. I start my adventure. Let's see what we got. World generation, card generation, item generation, something undefined falls from the sky. <laughs> okay, I'm ready. I'm prepared, I guess. And now we're here. So we have a strange obelisk. There's, there's a lot to see on this screen, man. Uh, so I'm glad we have a tutorial. You are in front of the center card. Simply swipe with the mouse to move or use arrow keys slash WASDA. Um, click to interact. Each card has a number showing its interaction points. When they come down to zero, you will collect resources. Sometimes you may get bonus ones with each click. That's all you're giving me. Okay. <laughs> okay, fair enough. I'm going to open. So this is my inventory. I can carry 40 pounds worth of stuff. Uh, sure. And I got a one, two, three down here. Don't know what that means. This appears to be a crafting menu. Uh, so I should probably try to craft, like, tools. <laughs> Those seem good. So sticks and stones, they may break my bones, but they can also craft me a, a pickaxe, which seems good. And then also a wooden club, which is also sticks. Uh, or a stone knife, which is also sticks and stones. Or a javelin, which is also sticks and stones. Okay, we're, we're learning very quickly. We also have what appears to be grass fiber, uh, since I saw that in the previous screen. Uh, so we need that in order to make ropes, which uh, apparently will be essential for my survival. So I'm learning a lot already. Uh, we also have the strange obelisk. The obelisk does not react. Okay, sure. Um, we're not timed in any way, but we do have energy points. So let's let's move to the stone and collect it. That used one energy point, and now I have one stone in my inventory. Very good. Um, I'm going to... I'm going to move past the grass and, and just grab some more stone. How to work. You consume one energy point with each interaction or every 10 steps of movement. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, when they drop to zero, you will pass out and be vulnerable for 10 turns. Seems horrible, actually. I can recover energy by taking a breath through the upward swipe. Alternatively, by sleeping in a bed during the night. Okay. So the upward swipe, I, I rest for a little bit, is what it seems. I'm going to grab some of this, this plant fiber, okay? So if I take an upward swipe, I took a breath, I regen a little, okay. But we probably want to make sure that we, we get to, like, having a tool before nighttime, maybe. I also think that getting a mushroom, probably 50% chance to hurt yourself by two, restore hunger by two. Do I see my hunger is right here? Okay, very good. So this tree is obviously our our big, this is a big moment for me. I need to full Minecraft this tree. Um, that gave us a stick, which is great. Because we have a stick, I'm going to craft an axe. I think this is important. So weapons and tools can be equipped by, by clicking equip or by dragging them to the hand slot. Keep in mind armor is equipped only by clicking equip. Sure, um, I can have two equip tools, left click or right click to use it. If a tool does not serve the purpose, you will interact with your bare hands. And using a tool consumes a durability point. Okay, so now that I have my axe, I'm going to put you on left click. And I'm going to chop this freaking tree down. Okay, so one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven. I got a stick. We love that. We get six sticks and three logs. Okay, huge. That's huge. So I want to craft something, uh, but I got I to gotta look at what I want to actually craft. Um, I think a pickaxe is a good idea. And then with my remaining, I would like to get something here, right? I could do the javelin. I could do the knife. I mean, the javelin... You have more attack, believe it or not, and more durability at the same time. But this provides me with stealth, which I, I don't really know um, what's going on. And then this, this gives me stealth and it's also throwable so i guess craft me a wooden club for right now um i have to imagine the others are, are better but I'm, I'm gonna take this for right now okay this is good build a bed excuse me <laughs> i didn't know a bed was was an option it is an option okay so a campfire is a good idea and a bed of straw is a good idea i need some more grass let let's be a little cautious about our movement um, and take a little bit of time to make our way back to, back to the obelisk. I just think that the obelisk is, is probably an intelligent place for us to be. I need more sticks. Okay, let's, let's take a couple of breaths here. Now, this is going to inevitably put us into nighttime at some point, is, is how I'm seeing this. Some berries are good. Some stone is good. It's nighttime. <laughs> okay. Uh, it has become night. During the night, you see only the central card. Use a torch to reveal adjacent cards. Some buildings, such as a campfire, can reveal adjacent cards. The night is full of monsters, but also full of secrets. Sleep if you are not ready to face it properly. Some areas can always be dark, just as if it were always night. So I can probably just take a breath through the night right i'm a little terrified I, I would really really like is there any way i can turn the logs into sticks i think that the answer to that is is likely no uh, allows you to build something in an empty card i think that that's also valuable because now i can actually like craft i can craft this kind of stuff but that that used up all my sticks for which i now have none so i really think that we want to we don't want to reveal crap. <laughs> oh, I can't I can't do this anymore though cuz I'm max energy. So now I now I have to reveal you, but that's fine. I will happily uh, chop down this tree. Okay, beautiful. Always check the weight of objects you pick up. The inventory has infinite slots. Interesting. Um, but when you reach a maximum weight, you become heavy and consume more energy. Leave the super, 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 superfluous, <laughs> I can't say that word, man, superfluous on the ground to preserve your inventory weight. You can always pick up the sack from the ground in the future. Okay. So I am very heavy right now, but that's, that's okay because I intend on crafting this campfire right now. Um, and I'm going to take those tools to do that. And then I'm going to interact with the campfire by making coal. How do I how do I do that? I don't know. Um fair enough. I don't oh, I have to I have to add fuel. So I'm going to add some fuel and then I'm going to cook coal, <laughs> which cooking coal has interesting implications, but I did it. So so that's fine. Now, I thought it said that the campfire can reveal Adjacent tiles it can okay. That's very that's very good um, So now we would want to attempt to build the the bed of straw, which I just need rope for um, Let's let's craft a rope come back here bed of straw build ya one two one two three four and the rope and I'm gonna sleep Th Honestly, that seems like a very good day to me. I feel like I have accomplished uh simply just greatness really now there's a deer just okay he's out of here <laughs> animals may see you and run away as soon as they can it's normal your footsteps make noise weapons such as the knife javelin or bow can make you stealth and give you a chance to not get seen interesting okay i do need food um i don't believe that i can cook these berries uh but i i think i would like to consume 
enough of them, right? You don't need to consume all of them, but enough of them seems good. Let, let's go to this rock and I'm going to start mining the rock. I also have a huge excess of energy. Seven stone. Okay. Some sticks on the ground. I'm, I'm not going to complain about picking up uh, some, some sticks. Berries are, are just good food for me. How's my weight? 32.8. I feel, I feel fine about that. Now the spring flower, I mean, I don't really know what that's providing me <laughs> at the current moment, but more advanced tools does seem good. Uh, a furnace also seems good. Blacksmith bench. So we, we need more sticks. Um, we need more stones, right? Ah, travel. <laughs> okay. I mean, I'll humor it. Where, where am I traveling? So we, we got more, more map to explore. I'm now in the forest. Okay. Terrifying, I think. There is an apple tree. Uh, and it's, it's hefty. I'm also about to lose my axe, but I can just craft another one, right? Stone axe. I'll, I'll just craft another. Put, put that sucker in my, my inventory. And then I'll, I'll do a little, a little smacky on this. I'm taking, look, I'm losing a lot of, it's nighttime. Oh, frick me. <laughs> okay. Um, pretty bad. Okay. Pretty bad, I think, to, to deal with nighttime. I'm going to travel back. Now, my hope is that all of these tiles I've already gone through. Oh, brother. <laughs> okay. Um, let's be intelligent about this. I'm going to craft a primitive javelin, and then I'm going to put said javelin onto my hotbar. I'm also going to uh, consume a couple of berries, and then I'm going to take some breathers right now to restore a little bit of energy, which I do think has, has value. And then I'm going to cry as I walk across here. I'm gonna pick up the flower, I'm gonna pick up the stick, I'm gonna pick up the stone, uh, frankly, I'm going to pick up the, the plant fiber. I know that eventually I'm going to make it back to my my home. Let's take some more some more breathers. I doubt they would throw some like truly cotton. Some truly horrific uh, enemies at me this early in the day. I never made it to my bed, man. I'm so stupid. <laughs> okay. Craft a torch. How do, I, how do I make a torch? I'm going to do what the game tells me to do. That seems like a good way to succeed. Uh, torch requires uh, whatever this is, which I, frankly, I don't know what that is. Um, so let's, let's see. Cotton can be used for crafting cool dress. Okay, sure. It's fine. Cool, cool dress for Tyler in the future. Um, I mean, look. Grab, grab berries. I know I should have, you know, optimally not done how I did that. Can I go to sleep? I can only sleep at night. So I, I gotta take some breathers. Let, let's treat today as just a resource collection around the base, right? Get some plant fiber. Uh, just stack up all of the the normal things that we, we typically spend a lot of time going and getting. You know, like berries. It's nighttime again. I gotta keep my eye on this up here, man. Because I'm gonna find myself in a, a real dicey position as time goes on. So give me the flower. Give me the berries. We know that right... I fainted. I ran out of thingies, man. So ten, ten turns pass when I faint. I forgot that every like 10 turns I lose in energy so I lost an energy right there fainting's not the end of the world here though I don't think because the reality is the bed's like right here well the bed's the bed's right here <laughs> go to sleep okay go to sleep we we like we like being asleep right now I want to go into the forest again. There's clearly also something on the far left as well right that I, I want to go back to at some point but let's let, let's take the time eat something if you're hungry yeah 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 yeah. i picked up on that i really did you don't gotta explain it let, let's go travel and let's see if we can find uh some new exciting things over in the forest i do need to still craft a workbench uh probably something that 
would have been intelligent. I am losing more stuff probably because I'm hungry. Is Oh no, dude, my inventory is heavy. I got a heavy ass inventory. Okay. Um I can consume flowers. They have a weight of 0. What's making my my uh place so so heavy, man? Can't be all the plant fiber. It's probably the the 15 stone that I have on <laughs> me right now. Um okay, I'm making some some very large mistakes currently. I'd like to travel back, which I know you're going Tyler, you just wasted so much energy. We we need to prepare ourselves for the future, okay? So we're just going to we're going to take a nice little walk back to our normal base area. I am going to grab this cotton because that seems more rare, but right here I would like to to build some stuff. So the workbench requires uh requires rope for which I can craft four of and then now I can, I need an equipped hammer. I can do that. You, you need not worry. Equipped hammer right here. Happy birthday. Come back. Look at this. Uh, we can make almost anything in this planet. So one, I'm going to take some breathers. Two. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. And then I have my workbench. Okay, so now I can make a wooden cup. Wooden cup, a useful container for distillates. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sure. We can craft uh, pickaxes. We can craft a lot of different weapons. I like the idea of a bow. Arrows are extremely expensive. But I like the idea of a bow. I also like the idea of just armor. Um, especially, like, th these are cheap. These are really cheap. Um... Let's craft a cape. Why not, right? And then we got the rope. We got a leather bag. Allows you to carry more weight in your inventory. That's a huge one. Okay. Um. So, let's put you on, right? Does that... How, how do you... I equip you. There you go. Okay. And then I'm going to go back to my bed. I fainted. <laughs> Brother. <laughs> I was one away from here. I should have should have rested. <laughs> should have rested. That's on me. That's on me. I I acknowledge that. I really do. Uh, what's my weight? Twenty five point four. You know what? That's that's really not too bad. That's really not too bad. Take a nap real quick. In the morning, we go into the forest and and look for what the forest holds for us. I know the apple trees. We can probably chop down and we can get apples, which there's there's value in that, right? Apples are are cool. They're they're a food source for sure. Um, I I know I have berries in my inventory, but apples, I mean apples are they're, they're good. Who doesn't like apples? They're like a universally loved uh food in life. Here, I'll eat some berries before I travel through the forest. Here, I'm really looking for for new things in here. Um, see like this oak tree. You're a hefty boy. You got 24 hit points on you. Uh, don't really know what to do with that. Let's just take some sticks. I should have thrown a javelin at the bird. Definitely should have thrown a javelin at the bird. Don't move so fast, Tyler. Don't move so fast. When when you see a, a little a little animal, let's let's go crazy. Now the forest has more wood than we know what to do with. That boar is, is terrifying. Um, so let's try to kill it. Okay. So I'm gonna, he ran away. Oh, that's like real bad. <laughs> I should not be here. Can I, can I use my spear? I mean, I think the boar is like right here. So if I hit you, one, oh, okay, you got me. Two, you got me. Three, you're gonna hit me again, I'm sure, okay. But guess what? Plus three meat, plus one leather. I'm going to consider that to be a pretty big win for Tyler. Now, there may be enemies here in, in these woods. Which is uh, scary, for sure. Definitely terrifying. Uh, but I'm, I'm like, really not that concerned. I clicked that board with a hammer instead of using my javelin. I'm pretty sure. I forgot that clicking... Oh, what the frick are you? 
Okay, I'm gonna hit you with a javelin. I've gained a skull. <laughs> a creepy skull could be magical powers. Fair enough. I mean, I, you know what? Hard to tell a lot of the time. Whether the skulls you collect are gonna have magic powers or not. This seems bad for me. That seems like real bad for me. Um, let's try to restore... <coughs> health? You're, you're trying to kill me. Uh, and now I don't have a javelin. Okay, I'm gonna craft a javelin real quick. You ready for this one? Um, primitive javelin. Craft ya? And oh, brother, you're just kinda giving me the one two right now. Uh, restore 20% chance to restore health by two. I mean, help me out a little bit. Oh, you're just gonna keep on hitting me though. I mean, every time I do this, I'm just dying a little bit more. Can I, can I leave? Okay, that probably would have been more intelligent. Consume. I gained a little bit of health. Okay. Um, well, God knows I have enough energy. <laughs> That's for damn certain. 50% chance to hurt yourself by two restores hunger by, by four. We're going to cook that as well in the future. Hello, friend. I hit you. You hit me. I'm gonna lose this this battle, so I would like to leave now. There may be another enemy around here. The flower is good. <laughs> Consume that, 20% chance, failed. At this point, I'm gonna take the damn berries as well. So it is daytime. I've now quite literally gone through the night. And I don't hate that, actually. I don't hate that, because now I'm already here. I, I really should set up a base of operations inside of here. So let, let's let's do exactly that. Now, I know it's an Alexa look, you know. We're, we're going to play this for a little bit, and then I'm probably never going to play it ever again. Um, but I think that it is still an intelligent decision to build a campfire and a bed in each area that we go to, right? So the bed, I need rope and a, a stick. So let's let's build a rope. And then you know what? One, two, three, four, five. Craft me another... I don't have any sticks. <clears throat> I'm just gonna... Excuse me? Punching the tree hurts you? That seems like a real problem for Tyler. Um, okay, so stone axe, craft me. And I, I really need that. What, what is this stone axe? I think you're like a... a Oh, God, now I'm duping the axe? <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> oh, God, and now I have... I have, like, broken stone axes. But then I have some that are, are not broken. I'm not really sure what's going on with that. And that's okay, right? That's okay. So, make me a bed right here. We're gonna one, two... Oh, I'm down to one, uh, one hunger. Eat some berries, brother. I am also uh, extremely heavy right now, and that makes total sense because my ass is carrying a lot of stuff in my inventory. I would really like to make this bed. The days are going much, much faster. <laughs> when you do a lot of crafting, days, they, they move on by. They move on by. But this sleep is going to be very good. Um, I am still dying, okay? We're, we're hurt, and we would like to, to become unhurt in the future. But I could... Ah, a distillate of health. Oh, I need another crafting table, man. Okay, I'm just gonna rebuild everything in this area for rope. We can make rope. Rope is... That's, that's easy money. One, two, three, four. And then, and then I come over here. Building. I need to have an equipped hammer. Guess what? Got one of those right here, my friend. Uh, equip your ass. No, like... Uh, there, there's some gooey bugs in this game that we can see, and that's okay. <laughs> it, it's a, it's an early, early access demo. We do not need to be too concerned about the, the gooey bugs at this point. I've had the code gooeys in the past, man. They are freaking miserable to code. Okay, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna ever hate on, uh, on a game for, for not having the gooey lockdown quite yet. They, they'll get it squared away. You don't have to worry. So, I need fuel inside of here. Let's dump in some plant fiber. And then I'm going to cook up a little distillate of this. And then I'm going to cook up a little... Gonna cook up a little one of you. 
I'll cook up some coal as well. There, there's no harm in doing so. So now I can, I can consume my distillate of health. Ladies and gentlemen, we've never been more back than this moment right here. Now, um, apparently this is not an ax. <laughs> That's right here in my inventory. That's a hammer. That's correct. So put the ax here instead. And then I'm, I can just knock down this apple tree. I'm just curious if we get apples out of it, right? Which I'm sure we do. Or we don't. <laughs> Why would we get apples from the apple tree? That just seems so illogical to me. Um, I want to drop you. By dropping you, you still exist in my inventory, which is an interesting, interesting situation. These logs are really heavy, man. I do not want to fight you. <coughs> no, stop it. <laughs> get away from me, you little freak. Go to sleep. I'm not dealing with the night. The night is... It's a mistake, okay? The nighttime is a mistake. We should have... We should have uh, just made the sun last all day. Why didn't we just move Earth so that the sun hits us uh, on all sides at all times? Just a huge mistake. Um, I really would like to drop enough things. Like, those mushrooms I really don't need. I do think I probably need this club. Um, let, how about we consume a steak? Now I have just enough space in my inventory. I'd like to get to the end of the forest. I want to see what's beyond here. I want to know what... Oh, hello, Mr. Deer. Goodbye. There's another one. Okay. I don't have a javelin, man. Where the frick did my javelin go? Okay. Uh, I'm going to make a javelin. Hopefully that doesn't scare my, my dear friend. And then I'm going to throw the javelin at you. I'm going to... I don't know how to do it. <laughs> I, I tried clicking him. I tried clicking... I, don't, I actually don't know how to attack the deer. Hello, friend. Oh, it's... Oh. <laughs> I, think, I think... So I understand a little. This has a 60% stealth chance. So it gives me a chance can be can be thrown without face enemies up close. <laughs> okay, uh, I don't know how to throw the javelin. I'll just tell you right now. Maybe there's something in the inventory I can click. Oh my god, it's just more forest. <laughs> okay, okay. You know what? We're in we're in forest two electric boogaloo. Exactly where I want to be. Um, I'm 39.9, ladies and gentlemen, we call that, uh, below weight. I just want to get through the forest and see if there's anything, uh, what the frick are you, Sir Nunos? Sir Nunos, the son of the dew. What are you? How can you exist? I mean, this seems, this seems bad to me. Oh, what the frick, brother? <laughs> okay. You're you're going crazy. I I don't know how to I don't know how to throw you. I don't know how to get past Sir Nunos. <laughs> Dude, the lightning sound, the thunder is so good. Are you just gonna insta kill me? Like when I hit you, <laughs> you hit me for four, and I hit you for zero. <laughs> He's gonna obliterate me. I'm dead. <laughs> Okay, well, yeah, that's fair. I respect, <laughs> I respect that. Um, at least we respawn at the obelisk. Uh, so we've learned, <laughs> we've learned a little bit more uh, about ourselves today. And then we know that right next to the obelisk uh, is is our our campfire. There is a bat right here as well. Um, I mean, look, I know this is a bat. I'm just going to try to hit the bat. He hit me. Okay, I killed him. I got a bat wing. I also ha heard the worst sound of all time. Oh, we lost our entire inventory, which is a problem. That bat was like... Mah. Okay. This is good. This is good. Dude, I, I, I really like this. Uh, it's a little janky, but I think that these games have to be a little janky in order to be good. Um, I'm intrigued to see what else is in it. Obviously, this is just the demo, right? So there's there's going to be a lot more to explore uh, in the full release. 
believe it or not, this game does not release until Q1 of 2025. <laughs> so there is a whole year of development that is still going to go into this one. Uh, and I'm excited to see what that year of development holds. Because I do think that they, they already have some really interesting stuff uh, cooking for this one. So check out Swappy World. I'll have a link in the description. You can play through this demo. You can try to beat Sir Nunos yourself uh, and not get struck by his, his lightning prowess. Uh, but for now, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, liking the video, much appreciated. I will see you tomorrow for some more new games. Hope to see you there. Bye-bye.